previamente en 90 segundos. ¡Sachi! ¡Es Marco, open up! ¡Wake your ass up, man! ¡Levante te! We're in danger. The heck you mean we in danger? That African terrorist group from our mission in 05, they're here and they killed everyone. Including Chloe. I know that you and Chloe had a pass. But we don't have much time. We need to continue this mission. So I need you to get the team together ASAP. All right. I'll make some calls. Make those calls. So what do you want from me? What do you want me to do? I need men. I need ammo. I need guns. All right. I can get you a few guys. More bodies. I'll get Not you just what three. I can. I'll get you what I can. I can handle the inventory. I can get you your loadout. But then that's going to be it. After that, I can't have any more contact with you. Okay, Marco? Don't contact me. Just give me the list. I'll get you what you need. And then I'm out. Ezekiel, Charlie, what do you say? Boko, no sweat. Let me add you. My mom may catch him and say, Oh, baby, I'm not. Aye, watch out. Tell us. In casa. You look like a strong, handsome man. Well built, just like your father. How did you know my father? Your father and I used to work at the embassy together. The embassy? Yes. You remember it? Yeah, I remember it, man. Any chance we got, me and my sister, we would go to work with Tata. We would run through the halls, play soccer in the yard. Eat all the fruit snacks in the cafe. Man, that embassy had a special place in my heart. I was there when that incident happened to your dad. Unfortunately, I couldn't help him out. I tried my best, but the damage was too much. Look, what the fuck am I doing here? Huh? Whoop it, eh? You know what, Ezekiel? You possess a very strong skill set. That we could use. I know very powerful men that want the revenge of the life that was lost that day, including your father. You want revenge for the lives lost that day? It's done. It's been almost 20 years. Okay? The government's not doing anything about it. And you aren't doing anything about it. What are you, a terrorist or something? Huh? Look at me. I'm a businessman. <laughs> okay, Mr. Businessman. What the hell do you want with me? What if I tell you 
But these very powerful men that I know, huh? these people could take all your burden away. The warrants that you have, the reckless driving, all the public arrogance and fights, the commotions you've caused, telling you with this power people who don't know, we can take all that away. Why don't you look at this list? This is the name of the people that murdered your dad. Chloe Martin, Jason Dykes, Thomas Carl, Santiago Morales, and Marco Torres. Yes, Marco. He's the one that led this whole entire slaughter. He is the person. He is our guy. Take a new brick. We're gonna get them. I'm interested. What's in it for me? Here's what's gonna happen. I have $10 million in cash for you after we eliminate these bad guys. How does that sound? You have a deal. Under one condition. You give me a passport and a check out of this fucked up country and we're good. Anything you need, son, I got you. We'll talk. You're gonna hear from me. In 30 days, you're gonna hear from me. I'm gonna give you a call. No. Hello. Hey, buddy. Hi, Dad. Where's mommy at? She went to Culver's. She, she what? She went to Culver's, you silly man. Papa, when did she leave? Dad, where are you? I'll be home soon, but I need you and your sister to stay with Grandma. Okay? Okay. I love you, buddy. I love you too, Dad. I'll see you soon. <laughs> I can't believe you're gone. I'm gonna miss you. I'm good, bro. I need five. If 
Five minutes, bro. South, I'll shoot you myself. Do you understand me? I'm gonna kill you when it gets here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Shut up! <laughs> hey, boss, check this out. What you got, bro? <laughs> Look who it is. Horror still. I already spoke to him. We got the team together. Hey, this is Nadia. Hey, Cop. Hey, Nadia. Where have you been? Where are you? Marco Torres. Marco! What? You leave my family out of this. It's about me. It's not about them. Put on a speaker. Oh, Dad. It's funny you mentioned his family. Because I had to sit back and watch his inheritance destroy mine. You know how that felt? Listen, I understand your pain. I didn't want to go through with that mission. I even pleaded to my commander. I left the military because of that attack. You know, something tells me you, you actually mean what you say, Marco. You know, I kind of feel like you're actually a genuine guy. But you can't erase what you've done to this. You understand me? Meet me at the train tracks no. in Parkville in an hour. And we'll see Miss Payne again. Please. Let me speak to my wife. Let me know she's alive. No! 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 You have one hour. We gotta go there now. No. No, nah, bro, listen. Bro, Don't drive this car now! Listen, something ain't right. You listen to me, man. That's my wife, brother. I know. Get your shit together, soldier. Listen to me. Listen to me. Bro, move this car, man. Listen to me. You got you to think. Bro, I will shoot you to get to her. Don't fuck with me, man. This is family. I understand your pain. I understand. 
but you gotta get your shit together, sold you. You gotta think, all right? You gotta think. <laughs> Please. Oh. Shut up! I know, bro. I know, I know, Prima. I know. I know. Listen. Listen to me. Listen to me. Get in the car. Hey, wait. Get in the fucking car. Oh.